hello everyone welcome back to the amps tutorial today we will learn that uh, how we can run our simulation so first of all we should go to our amps interface in previous tutorial we have learned that how we can add the first layer which was the electron transporting layer then we add the active layer which was the perovskite layer and then we add uh, HTL which was a whole transporting layer today we will run our simulation that for example if we we have added all the parameters of the material then how our device will behave so we should uh, click on this window and check that light is on and okay then if we remember so we save our device on the name of first layer so we should open that we check all the material that is titania the etl layer perovskite which is the active layer spiro which was the htl then we need to press this ok then we have to run and yes so we need to uh, wait for a few minutes then we need to check our results this is actually the jb curve which show that uh, what is the performance of our device under illumination uh, in this case uh, in this y axis is the representation of the current density the x axis is the representation of the open circuit voltage and we have the parameters that the open circuit voltage value we have on this interface uh, the current density we have and the fill factor and the efficiency we have also the shunt resistance series resistance and so on so this graph show showing that uh, what is the jv curve of our device under these conditions then we can also check uh, the energy band levels of our of our device which in this uh, on the left side uh, they shows uh, the the etl interface in the middle uh, it, is show, uh, it shows the perovskite layer and at the right side shows the HTL which is the whole transporting layer. So this is actually the energy band diagram which is uh, the Shockley contacts like that and then we can also check the contribute or distribution of the charges that we have free electrons, we have free holes, we have trapped uh, holes and electrons and so on. So this is actually the charge distribution of the device and this is actually the electric field uh, or the gradient of the electric field of our device and this is the current density uh, which shows for the electrons as well as for the holes and it also uh, shows us the total current density this is the uh, recombination and generation of the charges the green color uh, green uh, uh, line shows us the generation of the charges within the device and the red uh, line shows us the recombination of the charges uh, within the device in this case uh, the generation is quite better than the recombination and this shows the lifetime of the charges within the device and also this one is uh, actually the, the quantum efficiency of our device uh, with respect to the visible uh, light region in our uh, in coming videos or tutorials we will we will learn that how we can uh, we can operate or we can move these data to the origin and how we can make uh, our results more visual uh, for the article or manuscript so uh, please like subscribe and share and if you have any question, uh, let me know in the comments box. And thank you so much.